This is Ed. He's back and we put a totally brand new type of device in um, Mr. C here. And I just wanted to get his full shirt in because that's pretty cool. But uh, what's interesting and the reason I'm making this video is that um, Mr. C had, had tried a, a spinal cord stimulator for his uh, neck and arm pain some time ago. And, 2017. And you didn't go ahead with it. And why? Well, because it, in the middle of the night, I'd roll over and then to get or sneeze or cough and yep. I'd get a real high pain surge. It would shock me. felt like I was getting electrocuted. Okay. So it was like, mm -hmm. it felt more like torture than it yeah. was relieving pain. So I decided I'm, you know, I don't want that because I couldn't even sleep in the middle of the night without rolling over and getting beat. Um, but with this new device I use now, yeah. I've sneezed, I've coughed, I roll over and I don't get those high jolts, which is the, the system stays even. All the time. Not all the time. So it's like there's no high spikes. Yeah. And that's what I liked about it. So that, and that's what I got from the trial. And that's why I went with the implant. Just consistent stimulation, constant. regardless of position, yeah. coughing, sneezing, jolting, turning, twisting, all of it. It's just always the same. Always the same. Yeah. Okay. So um, this is a Saluda type stimulator. And what's, uh, for the, the viewer, what's substantially different about this is it is for the first time a spinal cord stimulator is listening to itself and listening to the cord as it stimulates. So it's kind of like uh, if you were to imagine a, a pacemaker that paces the heart and then makes sure that it beats. Mm -hmm. And not only that it beats, how well it beats. So every stimulation pulse within the cord is then listened to uh, just on its way up to the brain uh, as it's blocking the pain. So it knows always if it's too much or too little or just right. And it constantly uh, adjusts the stimulation to get precisely in the bandwidth of just right. And that's, that's the special sauce. And that's why it's not going to... Yeah, that's why it never... So um, another spinal cord stimulated company tried to get this right about maybe 10 years ago. They put an accelerometer in the IPG. In the, in the pulse generator, oh. so that it would know when you're lying down, and then they would program the stimulator for certain positions. But of course, and I think this is something like four million times a day it's listening. Oh. So, I mean, that's a lot, you know, it's a lot of listening. And it's recording, and it's trying to find out and, and then adjust precisely uh, how much stimulation you get. So it's never too much and never too little. So the, the real world impact of this, we have yet to know. You know, is this a massive change and everyone will change this we don't know yet yeah. but it is a hallmark uh, uh departure from the normal which is just stimulate and just tune it to the pain relief uh, i wouldn't have wouldn't have thought of trying it again yeah and you know after that trial you know you and i talked yeah. about it and yeah after the trial i was like wow it did what you said it did and I'm like, all right, go ahead. Right on. In. Right so, on. So this is our first follow-up after yeah, the put-in. So, so we got to get it tuned and get it It's been in there since September 13th, and today's, what, the 27th? 7th, yep. So, and so far, so good. It's like, you know, it's working. Okay. No well, you know, I, the aim is to get it tuned perfectly. Yeah. So and, and that's, that's our... This, and this yeah. Luda rep has been... I've, Two of the saluda reps have been working with me closely. Awesome. So, you know, Wonderful. trying to find That's two also key. answering every question I have. Perfect. And okay. I got, I think, four business cards with all four different reps. So <laughs> I'll call Going them. out to dinner, and there yeah. they are. Yeah. yeah. Okay, good. So, yeah. Well, I'll be anxious to know how you do a month or two from now. All right. Every, well, even more important. Well, hopefully, I'm not doing backflips, but I'll be doing something well, better. Well, that's okay. <laughs> if I see you doing backflips, I'll, I'll be very happy. Thank All right, you. thank you very much. And okay to post this on my YouTube? Yes, thing? Okay, cool. Thanks a lot.